you guys. I'm back from my fresh restock and I was at the farmer's market. We have a local farmer's market here in Santa Clara and check it out. I got a purple kohlrabi. So beautiful. And I wanted to remind you how I love this best. My father always grew kohlrabi in our garden. We grew it with him and we sliced it and we put it into some salted water and into the refrigerator to get nice and cold and crisp. So this time around, I just wanted to give you a plant fiber diversity tip. I'm leaving this beautiful peel on the kohlrabi for extra fiber and crunch and anthocyanin, this purple color that's in fruits and vegetables is super protective, super phytoprotective, protective from the sun's UV rays. So we wanna keep that on there. I'm gonna slice this up and get this in the fridge for our dinner tonight, to have alongside for our dinner tonight and check these out. Guess what I'm making with these? Mm. Probiotic pepper rings. I'm gonna mix them in with some jalapenos to cool things off a little. I'll make some escabeche with carrots and the onions and we'll ferment those. I'll make some probiotic pepper sauce. I'm excited about these. But if you find red jalapenos or red specialty peppers like this and you like spicy food, especially if you like to add capsaicin into your diet because it's very protective, um, you can buy these and pop them in your freezer and use them when you're ready to use them. Just wash them up, let them dry, and put them into a baggy airtight container and freeze them for when you're ready to make your probiotic pepper sauce. Great tip. And check out these. These are perfect. Pickle, uh, pickles. Oh. Um, perfect to make the kosher deli dills recipe. So if you're getting cucumbers in your local farmer's market, these are beautiful. They're just fresh picked, no wax. Nothing on them. These are perfect for fermenting into our pickles. And corn's coming in and it's looking fantastic. Oh my gosh, Jerry and I are loving this. Straight on the grill. Don't peel it, don't soak it. You don't need to do anything except put it in its perfect steaming package, that husk. It's nice and moist on the inside so it'll keep your corn perfect. Just grill it up and the outside will get a little bit charred but not too bad and it'll stay nice and hot in there and just peel it back and enjoy it. And then eggplants for our baba ganoush on a protective diet. So when I'm shopping at the farmer's market or in the grocery store, I'm always looking at everything and I'm IDing it based on my recipes. And if you're not familiar with all of the protective diet recipes, you can enter eggplant in that search box, that little green search box you can add you can put a recipe title or an ingredient and all the recipes that utilize that ingredient will pop up like the roasted eggplant, the eggplant parmenon, the baba ganoush is my favorite. So give that one a try. Get some yogurt straining and pick up a couple eggplants. Take care everybody. And Best of health. health.